Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for June the 5th of 2021, well, it is titled The Shining Clouds of Mars. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image taken of from or sorry from the Curiosity rover of a mountain on Mars, Mount Merku, and we see that in the distance and we can see the layered stretches of this mountain uh, showing signs that has, has been deposited in layers and that parts have been weathered away by wind erosion on Mars, which has been the primary erosional uh, method on Mars. And of course, around we can see other parts of the Martian soil here. And we see the distinct red color that reddish brown color that we associate with Mars due to iron oxides in its soil. Now up in the sky, we can see some clouds uh, in the Martian atmosphere. The Martian atmosphere is much thinner than Earth's only about one one hundredth as dense as Earth's atmosphere. But it still can have clouds in it and clouds can be made of uh, water ice as well. Those are one type of sea. Uh, other ones could also be frozen carbon dioxide. So without specific measurements, you can't really tell what they're made up of. But either car either water or carbon dioxide clouds. Now they're very icy clouds. So it's never going to rain on Mars, because the pressure is not high enough. So even if they were water clouds, there would be very thin wispy ice clouds up high in the atmosphere, or carbon dioxide clouds crystals of dry ice up in the atmosphere as well. Now Curiosity has been exploring Mars for over 3000 days now. So pushing up over eight years worth coming up on its ninth year of exploration of Mars and continues to keep going and explore so long outliving its original expected lifespan and still being able to explore and study different areas of the red planet. And of course it has now been joined by the Perseverance rover which recently landed on Mars and the two of them together are exploring different areas of the the Martian surface, giving us a much better understanding of the red planet. Now why studying Mars is so important is because it also helps us better understand Earth. When we look at just one planet, we don't get multiple perspectives to be able to see how things might work. So we can find things uh, things going on on Mars that may help us to understand better how things work on Earth. So even though we've been here on Earth, of course, since the dawn of civilization and studying Earth, we still don't know everything about the Earth, whether we're talking about its geology or its atmosphere. Those are still things that we're trying to understand even better. And studying Mars with things like curiosity and perseverance will help us get a better understanding of our own planet. So that was our picture of the day for June the 5th of 2021. It was titled The Shining Clouds of Mars. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Sunrise on Earth. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.